just um, gutted our kitchen so we have no stove or sink or counter space um, and I thought it was actually gonna be two ways like either we're gonna be really good on the diet or it was gonna be a complete train wreck takeout every night and it's been the like we've been really good on the diet like, we prepped everything on Sunday and like this is what we have we can't cook anything else so this is how it's gonna be and we spend all our money in our kitchen so we can't go out to eat every night <laughs> and that is the truth <laughs> Yeah, just making choices. I mean, yeah. you could just go out to eat and get something bad, but you know, put in the hard work, and you know, eating the bad stuff is going to throw off everything you're doing. Yeah, so. and, and for me, actually, you know, we changed our diet about three weeks ago, and this week at work, people I see every day start noticing it, and I think for me, like that, that makes me feel good. Is when I can say, like, someone goes, "You've really lost weight recently." I can tell, like, that makes me feel good because they see me like go to work lunches and only order like grilled chicken and right. <laughs> like really making the sacrifices and I think it's actually paying off finally. Definitely doesn't take too many examples of that happening to you to where you get a little bit more motivation, a little more pep in your step to keep going. Yeah. And also a couple days last week at, during lunch I went and did the, um, the fit class just to try to like burn an extra like 500 calories. <laughs> um, just to kind of like, you know, instead of eating lunch at my desk, I got up and did the fit class and went back to work within the hour and that was great. Yeah. It's, uh, you know, I think we'll, we'll have some good numbers to show everybody here when it's eight weeks is up. So yeah, for sure. it, it's been worth it, you know, 100%. You know, it's not always easy. Life's not always easy. But, uh, you know, it's choice they make. Yeah. And even without a kitchen, we're going to do it. <laughs> I think in the six uh, in the six weeks, but about 16 pounds I've lost. Uh, you know, through injury, uh, you know, dealing with injury, dealing with vacation, dealing with uh, you know, having to make some adjustments to your diet, like we've you know been over. So, lots of things are coming getting your way, but it's having the support here, of having a great coach, couldn't have done it without it. So we basically started taking some of the workouts and regressing them. 
And I've actually kind of designed a whole new workout just for him. And it's really the kind of same workouts I use for people that have any kind of spinal injuries, low back pain, um, pain in their hips. So I'm kind of scaling Scott back to that so we can kind of get him back to a point where he's able to kind of do all those uh, exercises he was doing before at, at the same level. Um, also, I've got uh, because Brittany is kind of moving to a different level, I added some workouts on her on the app. So she's actually going to Longwood and doing some some extra workouts at at Longwood using the Trainerize app. So that's kind of a way that we've utilized um, some of the new things that we're providing here at EW to give them more um, to give them more, so they can actually you know burn more calories and continue to to grow in this program. Thank <laughs> you.